All right, let's take a look back in history. On this day, back in 2018, Elon Musk sent a succinct nine-word tweet that rocked the world. It read, I'm considering taking Tesla private at $420, funding secured. It was the start of a multi-hour tweet storm that sent Tesla shareholders on a multi-year roller coaster ride. Drama that started about 30 minutes earlier with an unsourced news report that the Saudi Sovereign Wealth Fund had built a $2 billion stake in Tesla. Now, it all concluded hours later that day with a blog post on Tesla's website that said if the decision to take Tesla private didn't depend on a shareholder vote, it would already be official. Now, let's just state the obvious. From the start, the plan was absurd. If not for practical purposes, certainly for financial reasons. $420 a share ascribed an enterprise value of about $80 billion to the company at the time, which subtracting Musk's then 20% stake meant about $66 billion would needed to be raised to complete the transaction. That would have been then and would still be now the largest leverage buyout in world history by a mile. Now, the lack of details about the funding was also a head scratcher. And while the stock did rise 11 percent that day, it closed around three hundred and seventy nine dollars a share, 10 percent below Musk's 420 strike price. And at that point, investors had become numb to the spitfire nature of Musk's leadership. Ultimately, the tweet storm, it led to multiple lawsuits and brought Musk the attention of the SEC, which did broker a deal where investors would recover about twelve thousand dollars each. Well, that's about $40 million in total for the losses incurred from that fateful day back in 2018. 90-day historical volatility on Tesla stock has already been wild. We talk about a stock here that was trading at three times that of the NASDAQ 100 on a volatility basis. Average daily changes were about 2.5%, which compared with the S&P of about 0.7%. And while Musk in that memo to employees said privatization was all about creating the environment for Tesla to operate best, Wall Street raised a lot of questions as to whether that idea was more rooted in personal grievances around short sellers. Nevertheless, all that drama, well, it actually kind of worked out for some shareholders and certainly for Elon Musk himself. Tesla shares have rallied almost 700 percent since that day. And Musk has added almost $200 billion to his net worth to make him the most richest person in the world.